Well, the holidays are dubbed as the most wonderful time of the year, but all the lights, the decorations and appliances, they can be downright dangerous, especially for young children. 27 First News reporter Lindsay Watson is live in studio with a list of ways to prevent holiday hazards. Hey, Linz. Hey, Julie, that's right. Well, as a parent, even I know it's impossible to be vigilant every second of the day, especially over the holidays. Between sparkly holiday decorations, festive gatherings with family members and friends, and all of the gifts, the holidays come along with unusual dangers. So here's the 411 on some of the biggest holiday hazards for kids with tips on how to safeguard against them. Last month, a report released by the Consumer Product Safety Commission revealed that toy injuries alone resulted in 185,000 visits to the emergency room and 11 deaths among children under the age of 15. We know what children do. We manage about, uh, in our center here in Ohio, about 20,000 uh, cases of children getting into something a year. It's daily to us. Things like tree ornaments, light bulbs, tinsel, small toys and button batteries are all potential choking hazards for small children because they may block their airway. Coughing, breathing difficulty and obstruction. But kids playing with those toys, if they get the battery out and swallow it, which they do, um, that gets us fairly concerned. Even decorative holiday plants like mistletoe, holly, and poinsettias are considered potentially poisonous and should be kept out of reach of kids. But they're not as dangerous as, as perhaps their reputation is. This holiday season, experts urge parents not to hesitate to call the poison control hotline. Parents are sometimes a little hesitant to call, but we understand. We're going to let them know if this is a um, you know, something that they can manage at home. Here's some simple remedies. This is what to watch for. Or if this is something dangerous and we have to go further, but you're going to you're going to know right away. And we have more details on potential holiday hazards that you need to watch out for, as well as the number for your local poison control center listed over on our website, WKBN.com. But for now, reporting live in the studio tonight, Lindsay Watson, 27 First News at 11.